Good morning. It's been a minute. It's been a long minute. But um, I got up and I was like, you know what? I'm about to record this video today. I'm going to do it. I look a hot mess right now. But as you can see by the title, we're going to do a full Valentine's Day get ready with me. So I'm about to, the first thing I'm going to do is go wash my face. You know, get ready, brush teeth. And then I'm going to wash this hair. It's just, it's, it's looking real crazy right now. I'm looking so crazy right now. But, <clears throat> yeah, so that's the first thing I'm going to do is wash my hair. I'm just going to take you guys through the whole entire process. Getting ready, doing my hair, my makeup. And I have, like, three outfit choices. And then... At the end of the video, I want you guys to comment down below and tell me which outfit I should wear. Basically, you know we still in quarantine, still have a pandemic going on. I'm not really going anywhere. This is just a hypothetical video. <laughs> if the world was open and I had options to go places, this is what I would do. This is what this video is for me. I mean, some people are still going out acting like, you know, nothing's happening in the world. But, um... My plans for Valentine's Day are all, like, everything that I have planned to do, we're doing it at home. Let me go start because I have a lot of things to do. It's going to take time, and I have to charge this battery a little bit. All right, so we're making some progress. My hair is washed and blow-dried. Yo, my hair is growing so much. Like, this is crazy. I swear I just straightened it, like, beginning of January. And I swear it's grown since then. It's like so much thicker than it used to be. Like I used to be able to wash, blow dry, straighten my hair so fast. Now it takes so much energy, so much time. Yeah, so I'm about to straighten my hair. And then I will show you guys the next step in this get ready with me process. Y'all, it is a process. See, all men have to do is get a little haircut. You know, put a little outfit on with their little shoes, and that's it. No, we got to do so much. Hair is done. Hair is done. Looking cute. Okay, it didn't come out as good as it came out last time I straightened it, but this will do because I'm not going to do nothing but sweat it out tomorrow morning when I work out anyways. So, yeah, so the next thing that I'm going to do is... um. Clean up my eyebrows. I have like some stray hairs under there. All I do is take my tweezers and I clean that up. Already got my nails done yesterday. I just got like a basic nude. I didn't do anything crazy. I waxed my own lip at home and I already did it last week. So I don't think I need to do it again. What y'all think? No, right? No. And I already did my nose hairs. I do those too. I have like... You know what? I'm about to show you guys. I'm going to show you guys what I do. Hold on. I'm going to have to run out, run to a doctor's appointment, and come back and finish this video. But I'm still going to show you guys what I do. So this is what I use to trim my nose hairs. You put it up there, and then you just clean it off. Rinse it off with hot water, clean it off. And it's cool. But I already did it last week, and I don't see anything, so... I don't need to do that and I already waxed my lip but I'm gonna show you guys what I do what I use when I do wax my lip so I have this whole kit right here that oh shoot I have this whole kit right here that I got from Sally Beauty Supply like as soon as the pandemic hit and I was like, oh my, I was freaking out because I couldn't like get my waxes or whatever. I don't use it for my body. I just use it literally just to wax my lip. I was going to try to do my eyebrows, but not today. I got to prepare myself for that because I ain't trying to jack my eyebrows up or whatever. But this is what I use right here. And I got this from Sally's. And I also have the, um, I don't use that cream wax that's on the, that came with it. I use the, the hard wax beads. And it's great. You just put it on the stick, put it on, peel it off like they do. Literally, it's like the same wax that they use at when you go get a wax. 
So that's what I use when I wax my lip. But I don't need to do it today. So yeah. I'm about to use these tweezers. That I've had for so long. But they're the best tweezers ever. I don't remember where I got them from. I can't find anything like it. But I'm just going to clean up under my eyebrows. And then I'm going to head out to my appointment. And I'll come back. And the next time you see me is probably when I am doing my makeup. So, we'll be back. That is a wrap for the brows. Look like I just got a fresh wax. Minus this little situation. But, yep. That's it. That's all I do. Guys, go get some microblading. It is a time saver. It is a life saver. All you got to do is clean up. You don't got to pay for waxes anymore. None of that. I am back. I actually decided to um, curl my hair and put some flexi rods in. I wanted a little bit more volume. I just didn't want it flat down. Yeah, so I'll show you guys how that came out after I do my makeup. Hopefully it came out right or I'm going to have to just recurl it and then show you guys there. But um, So now the next step is doing my makeup. So now I'm just going to show you guys how I do my makeup. I'm pretty basic as you all know. I don't think I'm going to do any eyeshadow. If I do, it'll be very, very minimal. Like, very minimal. I am going to do some eyeliner. And, um, yeah. So, in the next clip, you're going to see me doing my makeup. But I'm going to play some music and speed it up a little bit. So that this video doesn't end up being like super, super, super long. So I think my makeup came out very, very good. I don't usually do a nude lip like this, but I really like it. Hold up. Now we got to see what's going on with this head top, y'all. Ah, I don't know what is going on with this hair, but... Let's take these down and we'll see. This side actually came out pretty good. So I don't think I have to touch this side, but this side, yeah, 
I'm gonna have to redo this side. So. I usually count to 10 in my head and then I let it go. Look at my gray hair just popping out all willy nilly. Won't ever let me be great. Yeah, y'all see them gray hairs? Why they always gotta be like standing out and going the wrong way? They could at least follow the direction of the hair. You know what I'm saying? Like, why they gotta be all. I actually like this side part going on right here. I think I'm gonna leave it like that. I'm feeling this side part. Hold up. What, up. what have we done here? So you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to take these pieces right here. And I'm going to curl them this way. Instead of the other way. Okay. Who is she? Who is this girl I see? I normally do my side part on this side, but maybe this might be my side. I don't know. I'm giving a lot of forehead, but you know, that's just genetics. I think we did everything, y'all. We did everything. We did eyebrows. We did our nose hairs. We got our nails done, toes done. We got us some wax. Okay. Um, Makeup, faces beat, hair is done. So now... We have to find a cute outfit. I already know what shoes I'm going to wear. I already have a bag. And I have two options of dresses, okay? So I'm going to show you guys those two options. And and we'll see which one makes it to the date. Yeah, I feel I lie. One by one. Then my stepping on me out to my end. I then be two by two. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Tell him, man, I tell him, man, I tell him, me then go slow. Then my feeling, no my vibe, and see these girls, then go down.